there's a new breakthrough on finding DNA without bones. You no longer even need bones anymore to find prehistoric human DNA. Just the waste left behind by these prehistoric humans. Yeah, in sediments. So like uh, when the bones decompose, they leave cells. And in the sediments, you can just, you don't even need a physical bone or skull. Now their teeth don't disintegrate, right? They do after a while, but this is a new technique. They took samples from eight different caves, and the caves were in Belgium, Croatia, France, Russia, and Spain. And those caves were inhabited by modern humans, and then Neanderthals, and these new creatures they found that are similar to humans. They're making great scientific discoveries just based on technology. And these other ones were called Denisovans. They also found a variety of animals that were extinct, and so now they don't even have to rely on, oh, we have a complete skeleton skull of a human or a bone or this. They can just get a bunch of clump of crap. Literally. Yeah, and then say, okay, this is this little area, let's take a sample. Oh, that's Neanderthal. This one's Denisovian. This one's a saber tooth or whatever. And so it's just, just, Well, even having new breakthroughs, finding new, new species, new creatures even. Exactly. So they're saying in the future it'll become possible to recover substantial parts of nuclear genomes that they would need a lot more fossilized evidence or bones in the past in order to accomplish the These same thing. These are exciting thing. times, magnified with great breakthroughs. Oh my gosh.